here are the my top 10 favorite Leprechaun franchise kills. So, uh, at number 10 is Joe from the first Leprechaun. Uh, this is one of the most iconic Leprechaun kills. The Leprechaun kills him with a pogo stick. Uh, it's kind of gory, um, and it's very creative. Uh, it's, it's one of the standout kills of the franchise. So, I like it. It's, it's just kind of creative. Number nine is Matt from Leprechaun Returns. He gets decapitated by, a uh, by his own drone. Uh, so, it's kind of cool. Drone kills are always pretty cool. Uh, but then this one is also a decapitation, so that's, that's very cool. Uh, the leprechaun overrides the drone, decapitates him. It's very bloody. I really like it. Number eight is Morty from Leprechaun 2. Uh, he, uh, locks the leprechaun in a safe, and then he gets three wishes, but he messes it up. And he wishes for his gold, but the gold gets into his stomach. He wishes for the leprechaun to get out, but he has to open up the safe himself. And then he wishes for the leprechaun to get the gold out of him. And the leprechaun tears his claw into his stomach and just rips open his stomach and gets the gold out. So he dies. Um, it's not bloody. Uh, it honestly should be, but there's no blood. But it's just... A pretty interesting kill. The leprechaun uses his wish again uses his wishes against him, so it's very cool for that. Number seven is the Leprechaun, I guess. The creature from Leprechaun Origins. Um He gets decapitated by Sophie at the end of the film. Uh it's pretty gory. It's cool that she kills the villain in the movie, the monster in the movie. So, uh, that's why I like it. It's a pretty good kill. Number six is Fazio from Leprechaun 3. Uh, he wishes to be the greatest magician in the world. Uh, and then the Leprechaun finds him and then, uh, uses his own show against him, traps him in a box, and then cuts him in half with a chainsaw. So it's pretty cool, it's pretty scary, and there's some blood in it. Blood squirts out of the box. So it's a very cool kill. Number five is <clears throat> the barista from Leprechaun 2. Uh, uh, he's making fun of the Leprechaun, and then the Leprechaun uh, doesn't like, like that, so he stabs his hands with utensils and then um, turns... Uh, steam onto his head and like cracks open his head uh, by steam so it's pretty scary there's some blood so it's easily the standout kill of Leprechaun 2 and it's one of my favorite kills of the franchise number four is Jenny from Leprechaun Origins uh, this is the standout kill of Leprechaun Origins um, because she's not killed by the creature she is killed by one of her friends, actually. The leprechaun tricks her, uh, pushes her through the fireplace, and then Sophie axes her in the face. So it's very surprising, it's scary, and there's some blood in it. Uh, it's a very impactful kill of the movie. Number three is Loretta from Leprechaun 3. Uh, she wishes she could be beautiful, but the leprechaun turns the wish on her and makes her ugly and then just uh and then just blows up her body and then just blows up her body she blows up he blows up parts of her body inflates them and then he actually blows her up so it's a very cool kill uh kind of bloody um and it's an explosive kill so that's always cool <clears throat> number 2 is Ozzy from Leprechaun Returns. <clears throat> it's the first kill of the movie. Uh, he gets well water into his face, and then he doesn't feel good. And then the Leprechaun tears out of his stomach. Uh, it's, it's gory. Uh, it's kind of impactful because they're killing a character from the first movie. Um, and it's the start of the movie. 
the leprechaun finally comes back. So, uh, Ozzy is my second favorite leprechaun kill. But my number one favorite leprechaun franchise kill is Andy from Leprechaun Returns. Uh, he, he's fighting the leprechaun. Leprechaun throws him. And then, um, he throws something at the leprechaun, uh, and then... The leprechaun strips the screws off the solar panel. The solar panel falls and splits Andy in half. Probably not the most believable kill, but uh, it's my personal favorite. Um, it splits him in half. Uh, his, both sides of his body just fall to the ground. It's bloody. It's in front of his friends, so it's a pretty scary kill. Um, so Andy, for being one of the bloodier kills of the franchise... Andy comes out to my number one favorite Leprechaun franchise kill. Thanks for watching.